you are on one of those journeys that seems to be very difficult for other people to understand. You even have a difficult time understanding it yourself. In a previous lifetime you were very committed to the same person for an extremely long time. You came into this lifetime to experience a bit of variety. Change is a big word in your vocabulary. It could almost be your middle name. You are always constantly looking for the next big thing, the next great adventure, and the next love of your life. It's okay. Don't be so hard on yourself and your inability to commit to something for a long period of time. One of your challenges is taking on responsibility. Deep within you, however, is a very spiritual being that is just waiting to be awakened, and that will happen eventually. You will experience so much change in your life that at some point you will be forced to develop a strong spiritual side to make sense of it all. This will bring a tremendous amount of peace to you. Your life's experiences could easily be turned into a movie, or a book. You stand the chance of making a lot of money in life, and your biggest challenge if this happens will be holding on to it. Invest. Make wise choices. Don't blow it. Marriage and long-term relationships are extremely challenging for you. They remind you too much of the past life where you were committed to a fault and there's a part of you that wants nothing to do with that this time around. But, you may change your mind if you meet the right person. Lightning could strike. Until then, be happy being single. You are solid and have a strong foundation. Your family, your culture and your community is very important to you. You are very grounded in your convictions and your beliefs. You do best in nature. You feel very much at home here. Nature is extremely healing for you. You are very disciplined in your work life. You are very organized, possess a lot of determination, and are very good with detail. You are a hard worker and able to see things through to the end. Your endurance is keen. There is a tendency to become overworked, but a short trip to your favorite place in nature makes everything better. When things get out of hand at work it's important to find some time to play. This will lighten things up quite a bit. You possess an artistic flair that also needs to be expressed. With so many talents at your disposal it can take some time before you truly find what you love doing on a long term basis. Don't give up the search. You will definitely find your place. It's always important to stay focused on your current task at hand, and leave room for exploring new ideas. You have an inner guidance that will lead you exactly to where you need to be. In order to make sure that you don't drift too much in your professional and intimate life, stay strongly connected to your faith. This will ground you. And although you can be very determined, don't give in to being too stubborn or close-minded. Always leave room for expansion. Open yourself to new ideas and new concepts. This will allow you to grow in very healthy ways. Since you were born under the astrological sign of Sagittarius you can be, frank, enthusiastic, stimulating, generous, impulsive, open and honest, candid, fair, sensual, carefree, eager, possess good judgment, sincere, adventurous, and a positive thinker, but you can also be restless, optimistic, tactless, intolerant, domineering, blunt, rigid, overconfident, demanding, aloof and irresponsible. Here are some suggestions on how you can bring positive change into your life, stand up for your beliefs, learn to practice forgiveness, pay attention to the details, commit to your choices, analyze the situation completely before deciding, be sensitive to others, Watch what you say, be open-minded, be open-minded, be open-minded, and most importantly learn to love yourself and others unconditionally.